Welcome back to the Sports Source. This segment brought to you by Zen Sports. Folks, Zen Sports, they are the kings of cash back. Sign up using code SOURCE, as in Sports Source. You're going to own, you're going to earn 5% cash back on every single bet you place for the first 15 days, all with zero limit. You know, some of these places, it's like, well, we'll give you credits. They give you cash. And they say, well, you can only bet 200. They don't have a limit. So 5% cash back on anything in the first 15 days if you sign up with code SOURCE, Zen Sports. Go to the App Store. Go wherever it is you go to get an Android app. I don't know. I'm an iPhone man. Uh, <laughs> go wherever you go to get those apps. Download it today. Zen Sports. Sign up with code SOURCE. All right. Let me tell you what's coming up. Mondays this fall, we'll be there tomorrow. This is uh, Bob Hodge and myself joined Tyler Ivins and Will West for the roundtable. Mondays, 3.30 to 4.30 on WNML. That's 99.1 The Sports Animal. Jeff Jarnick will be happy now that I got it right. Uh, let's take a look at the Cavaliers line leaderboard. This is you folks at home. Uh, it's bad news for Aaron W. He dropped this week. <laughs> he missed one of his questions. But you see Zach W., Robert M., Chris N., and viewer 5438, David N., Bradley S., they're all in the lead up here for a very nice prize we're going to get to in a second. You can play, too. And the thing is, there's plenty of games to go. You can catch up. So if you haven't been playing before, go ahead and jump in now because other guys are going to get – guys and gals are going to get it wrong. You can get it right. Climb right back up the standings. All right, let's tell you how we play this thing. Each week, Chucky C. Note sets the Cavaliers line as well as the total points over under for Tennessee's next game. Use the QR code that we're about to show you or visit sportsource.tv forward slash picks to register via Facebook or Google. Make your picks by Wednesday at 9 p.m. When you get your picks in, serves as the tiebreaker. That's why somebody with 7,000 points is number one and somebody with 7,000 points is number five. The number one guy is getting his picks in quicker right now. <laughs> the champion at year's end is going to receive a free three-night stay in the Smoky Mountains from Parkside Cabin Rentals. Chuck Cavalleras, I need a breather. So what, what are you doing with the line this week? Well, I tell you what, when you look at this game and, and our, our, our VFLs, you have to do something to affect Spencer Radler and, and Xavier Baguette, Le, Le Baguette. Uh, he's the Jet. He had a 75-yard touchdown catch. The pass went three yards past the line of scrimmage. You have to affect those guys because uh, uh, Radler was 18 of 20. He completed seven, 17 passes. I look at this game. I think it's kneeling at night. I'm going with the Vols. Home field advantage. I've got it at 12 and a half, Tennessee. All right, the line 12 and a half for Tennessee. What are you doing with the total points over under? Well, I mean, I think you nailed it, John. South Carolina close to 30. They can get there. The makeshift line played much better, uh, especially running the ball. They gave the Mario Anderson uh, 26 carats. So what does South Carolina do running the ball? That's your other key step. Okay, 12 and a half is the line. 62 and a half is the over-under. Let's go ahead and show you how people are standing up uh, here on our group. Mike Stoll still in the lead with 7,000 points. Josh Ward right behind him. Sterling, Bob, Will, and myself all with 5,000. Daniel and Jimmy at 4,000. Marlon, I'm not going to Vegas with you. You're at 2,000. <laughs> and Kevin Simon's been here one week, and he's already tied you. All right, uh, so here we go. Um, I will start with, well, Mike's not here, so I'll get his take later. That puts you first, Josh. Uh, Tennessee, minus 12 and a half. Who are you going with? Both games the last two years have been blowouts. I'll say it's closer this time. I'll say South Carolina, plus 12 and a half. He's going with South Carolina. All right, over under 62 and a half. Over. All right. He's going Carolina and the over. Sterling Hinton. Tennessee and the under. Ooh, Tennessee and the under. Uh, yes. Okay. Bob, I'll get his pick later. Will, I'll get his pick later. Me, I don't want to go next. Um, I'm going to go South Carolina, but I'll go over. I think it's going to be a shootout. I'll go South Carolina to keep it close. Uh, Daniel Hood. It's a tough one, but let's ride with Tennessee and the over. UT. Got to catch up to Sterling somehow. UT in the over. Jimmy Hines. Is Daniel listed ahead of me because he got his pick in first? Yeah. <laughs> Is that what happened? No, that's just, I won. That's just my kangaroo court. I oh. like him better. No, go ahead. What do you got? I've got South Carolina to cover the 12 and a half, and I've got over and maybe way over. Okay. Uh, Marlon Walls. South Carolina and over. Okay. Now Good I can't mock you because you went with me. All right. Yeah, <laughs> Kevin it. Simon, that's what it. are you doing? Tennessee wins. South Carolina covers. Give me the over. So most of us went South Carolina. That split it, though. We had a couple of UTs. Uh, had one under. 
And the so quarterback went with the defensive bat. Yeah, that is. Sterling Pearl. What's up with that? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I feel it. He's buying <laughs> Aaron Beasley. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, Coach Banks is dialed in. Be clear on that. Over, under, Dylan Sampson touches. What do we got? What is your number? It better be 20. <laughs> <laughs> it should be 20. Uh, 12. 12 and a half. Over, under. Over. Over. Under 10. Okay. I'll say over. It'll probably be under. Under. If they want to win, over. <laughs> I'd go under. I'd go under, too, and I think, like Daniel, it should be over, but I think it'll be under. We'll see. All right. The question about right is a fact. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. That's right. Is he ready? Because he looked like he had a concussion, but I'm no doctor. Wish I were. I wouldn't be with these guys. <laughs> I'd be driving my Lexus home. Thanks to these guys. Thanks to all of our sponsors. Thanks to you for watching every week. We appreciate it. We'll see you right back here next Sunday for a big show.